And for those who enjoy fireworks, have you ever wondered how those bright and beautiful colors appear? There's some interesting science behind how they're made, and News 19 meteorologist Corey Smith explains. You'll be seeing plenty of fireworks today as we celebrate the 4th of July, but they actually date back over a thousand years. The American Pyrotechnics Association says fireworks date back to around 6 to 900 AD, where Chinese alchemists would put gunpowder in bamboo shoots. This technology eventually spread into Europe by the 1400s and was refined into fireworks as we are more used to them today. The tradition of using fireworks for big events came over to the United States, and since its first celebration, fireworks have been used to celebrate the 4th of July. When continuing this tradition, you will likely run into fireworks that range over every color imaginable. But how do we get that range of color from gunpowder? Firework manufacturers have been able to create vivid colors by picking certain periodic elements that burn when ignited. Red, yellow, and orange are created by burning the elements strontium, sodium, and calcium, respectively. Green fireworks contain barium, blue, copper, and purple is a mix of strontium and copper, while white fireworks contain an assortment of titanium, zirconium, and magnesium. Knowing the chemical science behind fireworks makes you appreciate how we get all these red, whites, and blues you'll be seeing in our night skies over the coming days. I'm News 19 WLTX meteorologist Corey Smith.